Hi friends and welcome to your yoga flow for energy and peace that is going to be all about moving the body through sun salutations and lower body asanas to help bring more strength, stamina and flexibility into your body. So if you're ready, as always, grab a couple blocks if you need them, place them on the side, grab your mat and let's get started. We're gonna start at the back of our mat in a hero pose, seated on top of our shins. Take this moment to relax your hands on your thighs, close your eyes, sitting up as tall as you can here. Take a deep breath in, and exhale, release the breath out. And again, deep breath in as you grow nice and tall towards the sky. And exhale, release everything out. Take your shoulders up towards your ears and start to roll them down and back and back up. Just getting a little bit more range of motion and mobility into the shoulders. This should feel really good. Take it to the opposite direction now. So rolling them forward and up towards the ears and down and back breathing through this. Good, and then interlace your fingers behind your back as you sit up nice and tall. Inhale, open your chest up towards the sky. And then exhale, you're gonna release your forehead down to the mat and let your arms reach up towards the sky, stretching through the shoulders. Inhale, use your core as you slowly lift the upper body. Maybe you let the head fall back. And then exhale, diving forward and planting the forehead down onto the mat. Inhale, lift the body up, open the chest, open the heart, let the head fall back, and exhale, letting the forehead drop down onto the mat, hips towards heels. Keep your hips down the whole time as you inhale, lift the upper body, open the heart, let the head fall back, and exhale, dive it forward, melt down as you open the arms up. Try to reach the hands as far forward as possible to get this beautiful stretch through the upper back, through the shoulders. And then releasing the hands, reach them forward into your child's pose. And let us move forward as we inhale, cat and cow, rolling forward. Exhale, sinking the belly low into your cow and sit back into child's pose. Inhale, round the spine up, angry cat, as you roll forward. And exhale, sink the belly low, open the throat, and push it back into your child's pose. So not only are we stretching through the spine, but also through the neck. This should feel really nice here on the whole entire spine, from the base all the way up to the top, rounding forward. And exhale, sinking the belly low as you open the chest and sit it back into child's pose. Last time, inhale, roll forward, angry cat. Exhale, drop the belly, lift the head so you stretch through the front and push back into child's pose. Inhale, come forward, tabletop position. You're gonna inhale and drop your belly low now into a cow. And I want you just to sway your hips side to side here. Really getting a nice release through the hips. Also, this should feel good stretching through the front of the tummy, through the abs. Good, come back to neutral spine. And then I want you to round up towards the sky into angry cat. Keep the angry cat and then again, start to sway the hips side to side. This should feel really good for the shoulders and the back of the neck and the hips as well as you release any tension through the side body. Bring the back neutral spine. Tuck all of your 10 toes behind you. Inhale as you arch the back, look forward and exhale, pushing your weight back into modified downward dog, knees are bent. Inhale, drop the knees, arch the back, look forward. Exhale, push the weight back, modified down dog. Inhale, drop the knees, arch the back, look up. And exhale, push it back. Inhale, drop the knees, drop the belly, look up. And exhale, push it back. Feel free to extend the knees now. 
Wag the dog's tail as you sway the hip side to side. And allow some movement into the back of the legs as we pedal out the feet, lifting one heel up as we press the other one down towards the earth. Spreading the fingers nice and wide, really pushing the mat away with the hands as you push the hips back. We wanna feel the stretch through the back and through the calf muscles, through the hamstrings. Maybe you allow the head to shake it out, release any tension through the upper body and just breathe it out here. Notice how you're feeling, where you're holding restrictions and send the breath deeper into that area of the body. Take another deep breath in. Exhale, long breath out. Push your hips all the way back into your downward facing dog, keeping the body still like water. And then start to bend your knees, lift the heels, walk to the front of the mat into your standing forward fold. Inhale as you halfway lengthen. Exhale, fold. And inhale, rolling all the way up into a standing position. Open your arms, take a deep breath and reach for the sky. Exhale, hands to heart and samasthiti. Place your feet together at the front of your mat, arms along the side of the body. Inhale as you bend the knees, open the arms, deep breath in as you reach up, and exhale, lead with your heart. You're gonna swan dive down to the mat. Inhale as you halfway lengthen, and exhale, drop, or step your left leg back and drop your left knee. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, lift the back knee. Step the right foot back into plank. And exhale, you can drop your knees. Modified chaturanga as you push down. Inhale, baby cobra. Just a little back bend here. And then exhale, we push back into downward facing dog, piking the hips back. Inhale, we step our left leg forward. Drop your back knee. Modified low lunge as you look forward. Exhale, lift the back knee, right foot steps forward. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, fold. And inhale, coming all the way up into standing. Open your arms, deep breath in, reach up. And exhale, palms in front of your heart. Inhale, bend the knees, open the arms, reach up. And exhale, swan dive as you lead with the heart and fold forward. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, step your right leg back. Drop your back knee, look forward as you inhale. Exhale, lift the back knee. Step the back foot into plank position and exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. And exhale, push the hips back, downward facing dog. Inhale, stepping your right leg forward. Drop your back knee, look up. And exhale, lift the back knee as you step forward. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, fold, and inhale, come all the way up into standing. Open your arms, deep breath in, reach up. Exhale, taking your hands to your heart. Inhale, bending your knees again. Let us keep moving as we reach up for the sky. Exhale, lead with your heart and fold forward. Use your breath. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, step your left leg back, and then step your right foot back. So two steps into your plank position. Exhale, flow forward, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog, open the heart. And exhale, push it back, downward facing dog. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, let your hips push back, creating a nice long spine here. Inhale, lift the heels, bend the knees, look to the front, hop or step to the front of your mat. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, fold. Inhale, coming all the way into standing. Open your arms, reach them up for the sky. Exhale, hands to your heart. Going a little bit deeper into our sun salutation B. As we inhale, bend the knees. Squeeze the legs, reach the arms up into your chair. And then exhale, folding into your standing forward fold. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, step two steps into plank. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. And exhale, release back into downward facing dog. Inhale, stepping right foot forward, warrior one, as you ground your back foot at a 45 degree angle. Front knee over ankle. Re 
reaching up for the sky as you square the hips, deep breath in. Exhale, hands come down, pivot your back toes, step back and hover and take Chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, push back, downward facing dog. Inhale as we step our left leg forward, ground your back foot 45 degrees. Square your hips and bend your front knee nice and low. Reach up, deep breath in. Exhale, hands come down, pivot the back toes. Step the left leg back and take Chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, push it back, downward facing dog. Breathe it out. Three deep breaths here as we go deeper into this asana, into this pose, allowing our body to melt into the stretch. Take another deep breath in. Exhale out. And as you inhale, lift your heels, bend the knees, look to the front, hop or step to the front of the mat. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, fold. Inhale, squeeze the legs and sit low into your chair as you reach up. And exhale, stand up, hands to heart and samasthiti. Inhale, bend the knees, sit low, reach up. Exhale, dive forward. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, hop or step back into your plank pose. And exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, push it back, downward facing dog. As you inhale, step your right leg forward, ground your back foot, warrior one. Go nice and low with your front leg, reach up. And then exhale, bind your arms behind your back, interlace your fingers, open your chest. And then exhale, you're gonna dive your body forward, taking your right shoulder to your right knee. Inhale, square your hips, lift the body up. Open your chest, keep that lunge with the front knee. And exhale, diving the body forward. So keeping the lower body still as you lift the upper body, open the heart. And then exhale, diving it forward, reaching the hands up. Last time, inhale, lift. And exhale, dive and melt forward. Releasing your hands, you're gonna plant them down beside your foot. Pivot your back toes to face forward and lift your right arm to reach up towards the sky. Take a deep breath in here. And then we're gonna inhale as we crunch our elbow in towards our knee. And exhale, reach the right arm back. Inhale, crunch it in. Exhale, reach back. Inhale, crunch. Exhale, reach back. Inhale, squeeze and crunch. Exhale, reach up and back. Inhale, crunch. Exhale, reach back and hold. Looking towards the back hand. Reach that arm towards the sky so you're opening up in your high lunge twist. Feeling the stretch through the right glute muscle. And let us transition into wild thing. So our left leg is going to stay straight and pivot towards the left side. Right leg comes back behind us. Right knee bent your left arm over the head, right arm over the head. Opening the heart up towards the sky, lift the hips higher, deep breath in, long breath out. And then we're gonna slowly transition back into supported high lunge. So right foot comes forward, open the right side body up, deep breath in. And then exhale, pivot the body so the right hand comes down. Step back into plank position. And exhale, flow forward, chaturanga. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, push it back, downward facing dog. Inhale, step the left leg forward, ground the back foot. Warrior one, square your hips. Go deep and low with your front leg as you reach up. And then interlace your fingers behind your back. Inhale, open your chest. Exhale, dive and melt forward. Left shoulder to left knee. Inhale as you lift the upper body, open your chest. 
and exhale, dive it forward. Inhale, use the strength of your lower body to keep you still. Exhale, dive it forward. Feeling that engagement through the thighs and the quads as you inhale, open your chest, feel that stretch. And exhale, dive it forward and hold here. Really lifting the hands as much as you can to stretch through the shoulders. Releasing the hands down onto the mat, pivot your back toes. Right hand stays down and lift your left arm up. As we inhale, we're going to crunch our left elbow to our left knee. And exhale, reach straight back. Inhale, squeeze and crunch. Exhale, reach up and back. Inhale, squeeze it in. Exhale, reach back. Inhale, squeeze it in. Exhale, reach back. Inhale, crunch. Exhale, reach back and hold this twist as you look back towards that hand. Lift the left arm straight up to stack over the right. And let us transition into wild thing. As we pivot onto the right side of the foot, left foot comes back and open the hips up towards the sky as the left arm reaches up and over the head. Feeling this nice opening through the front body. Keeping that top arm straight, take a deep breath in. And then as we exhale, we come back into supported high lunge. Left foot forward, open the left arm out. And exhale, hand comes down, step the left foot back, plank position. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Take a deep breath in. Exhale out. And again, two more deep breaths in. Exhale out. Last time, breathing in through the nose. Exhale, let everything go. And as you inhale, bend your knees, lift the heels, look to the front, hop or step to the front of the mat. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, fold. Inhale, sit and squat low into your chair pose as you reach up for the sky. And exhale, stand up, hands to heart and samasthiti. Release your hands along the side body. Place your feet hip distance apart. Interlace your fingers behind your back again. Kind of take a gentle back bend. As you inhale, take a deep breath in. And then exhale, hinge from your hips as you slowly start to push the hips forward. And let your back release. Going as deep as you can into this back bend. Pushing the hips forward as you keep the hips over ankles and breathe. Another deep breath in. Exhale slowly. Lift the body up. Keep the hands interlaced behind your back. Bend the knees a little bit and start to fold forward. You can always release the hands if it's too much to keep them bind but this will feel really nice on the shoulders. Remember to keep a little bend in the knees to protect the back, allowing you to go deeper into this forward fold. Let the head be heavy, deep breath in. Exhale out. And then slowly start to release the hands down onto the mat. Inhale as you halfway lengthen. And then as you exhale, we're gonna step back into plank position. Flow it out one more time. Chaturanga. Inhale, upward dog. And exhale, push it back, downward facing dog. Bend your knees, lift the heels, look to the front, hop or step to the front of your mat, landing on your tailbone with your feet into a boat pose. So we're gonna lift our legs so that our feet are in line with our knees. Reach the arms forward, sitting up as tall as you can. And then if you like, you can extend the legs into your full boat pose. Being mindful that the back is straight here, relax the shoulders, deep breath in. Exhale out. And again, deep breath in. 
exhale releasing out of this posture as we come into crisscross applesauce at the center or top of your mat sitting nice and tall here take a deep breath in as we stretch and open our arms towards the sky exhale placing your palms together and down to your heart and again inhale make this flowy and fluid as you breathe in lots of air into the body and the lungs exhale hands to your heart and again inhale really stretch towards the sky as much as you can spreading the fingers and then exhale feeling that energy between your palms and down to your heart feeling lots of gratitude for everything that you are everything that you have and taking this time to do something amazing for your health and your well-being keep practicing with me all my love and light namaste